Hi. I'm Tony. And I'm... Well, you know who I am. The guy who has it all. Wealth, fame, impeccable taste in suits. What do you get the man with everything? A chance to give something back. Okay, Mark III test point. Starting with maneuvering thrusters. Hands by my sides, palms back. <laughs> good, feels good. All right, time to open her up. Opening targeting suite. Repulsors ready. Hands up, palms forward. Bullseye. You may have a problem, Tony. Pepper, I have a lot of problems. I'm serious, you and this armor. Do I need to stage an intervention? Only if I start wearing it to bed. Where are you anyway? Look out the window. Oh, hi, handsome. Looks like you made some upgrades. Three more targets to go. Two more targets left. One more. That's how it's done. All right, time to fly. Inspecting the foundations? I should add a secret entrance down here. You know, it's not a secret if you tell me about it. Enjoying the view? We should have lunch out here. I'm not climbing that. I'll carry you. <laughs> It'll be a dark day when I let you carry me wearing that thing. Anyone for tennis? No, you always win. Oh, come on, we can play doubles. What's next? Time travel. Mind if I watch? Oh, you know I work better with an audience. Hello? Anyone there? Huh. Let's start with boost.
Like if I swap the DC motor for a solar power converter and apply quarter inch magnetic articulation seals to the boot thrusters, it can reduce my drag coefficient by 10, maybe 10.5%. Okay. Should I be writing this down? No need. I've got a mind like a steel trap. Oh yeah? When's my birthday? Yeah, I'm sorry, Pepper, you're cutting out. Sounds like you need to reduce your BS output. Warm up the jets. I want to punch something. Fist rockets and gate. I'll try the other hand to throw a knockout. <laughs> Just like Happy Hogan taught me. Great aim. Nice. Time to punch out. Well done, Tony. Did you get what you needed? Or are you gonna go again? Maybe later, after I noodle on it some more. Sounds good. Meet me back here when you're ready. As you know, we have something to celebrate. Trapped in a cave with a gun to your head and a battery hooked to your heart really changes your outlook on things. My days of making weapons were over. I was proud of that. More importantly, Pepper was proud of me. Pepper! Downstairs! I should head downstairs and see Pepper. Pepper. Can't fault you for staring. Oh, please. I'm just shocked to see you out of the armor. I was afraid it'd fuse to your skin. That is not a bad idea. Oh, wait. That's worth more if I sign it. It's worth more if I sign it. I forge your signature better than you do, Tony. I'm capturing the moment. As of today, Stark Industries no longer makes or sells weapons of any kind. Sounds official coming from you. Have you seen my glasses? Think you left them in the living room. I'm headed up to the Overlook. Grab your glasses and meet me there. We can just catch the sunset. Sometimes to win, you have to quit.
There they are. Better way to see the world. Hey, Tony, looks like you found him. I'm waiting for you at the Overlook. Well, don't start the party without me. Just one thing I gotta do first. Pack up the past. Ah, the sounds of progress. New garage, new life. Lessons learned, but... It's time to turn the page. Dad always said stick to your guns. Sorry, Howard. We did things your way long enough. Gotta catch up to Pepper. Candlelit dinner, Tony? You're full of surprises. <clears throat> if you only knew. No silverware? We'll use our hands. Ooh, tapas. Uh, see. To start, Palma de Fuego. So, we're not having dinner. Um, not exactly. What? Yeah, right on cue. Stark Industries drones? Combat drones. Last of them, the dregs. I figured they deserve a worthy send-off. 
If you're gonna blow stuff up, at least move away from the fine china. Let's put the past in its place. Drone versus Repulsor. Stark versus Stark. Like I always say, Tony, you're your own worst enemy. So what's on the other plate? Codpiece? <laughs> no. Dessert. Something sweet? Bittersweet. Here goes. The gunsmith AI? It's time the old Tony hung up his spurs. Hey, boss! Miss Potts. Where's the party? Wherever you go. Not a fan of my new drones, huh? Well, S.H.I.E.L.D. is hot for him. Director Fury put in a full order. I canceled that order. What? You're shutting me down. Early retirement. You've earned it. Boss, I'm... It's not your fault. I made you to make weapons. Created you in my own image. And now you want to change that image. I want to change the world. So... Do I go to the trophy case or the trash? Oh, you're top shelf, pal. I'll keep you around. Suspended animation, but with full internet privileges. Hmm. Guess I'll take up surfing. You cool? Gunsmith? But me? Of course I'm cool. I'm him. Well, let's get to it, boss. A life of leisure awaits. See you on the other side. That wasn't easy. I'll take him. He was good at what he did. But what he did wasn't good. The world doesn't need another cruise missile or smart bomb. The world needs you, Tony. The world needs Iron Man. Strange. Morning, sir. May I get you something? Friday. You seen Pepper? I believe she's putting out a fire. Did I start it? She's been on the phone with the press all morning. Something about your surprise announcement caused quite a stir. Or don't you watch the news? Tony Stark, no stranger to stunning revelations, shocked the business world today when he named Pepper Potts the new CEO of Stark Industries. 
During a press conference, Mr. Stark admitted he had not informed Ms. Potts of his decision prior to the announcement. Perhaps you jumped the gun, sir. It's the opportunity of a lifetime. She's gonna thank me. I'm gonna kill you. I'm your assistant, Tony. You need to warn me before you do stuff like this. You're not my assistant. You're the CEO of Stark Industries. Or don't you watch the news? I should... I'm gonna... Pepper, I'm not always right. I mean, I'm usually right, Tony! But here's the thing. I wasn't put on Earth to sit behind a desk, and you weren't put here to handle my unpaid parking tickets. I was gonna ask if there are any more of them. There are glove boxes full of them, that's not the point. The company turned a corner years ago. We're a force for good in this world, and I want you to get that message out there. Don't people always try to shoot the messenger? No. Ah! Friday, who taught you how to fly? Uh, you did, sir. Unfortunately, I'm not in control right now. Someone has taken us over. Remotely. Out there! It's a Stark drone! A combat drone? We don't make combat drones anymore. The drone is encasing itself in some sort of hard light shield. Hello, Stark. Do I know you? I'm just a ghost from your past. Tony, look! Incoming! Time to die. Your airline just lost my luggage! Then file a complaint when we land! Override my safety belt! Pepper, I- I know! Just come back in one piece! Systems online. Just in time. I got a plane to catch. You cannot run your past, Stark. We'll see about that. Pepper, can you hear me? A little windy, but yeah, I hear you. Sir, we have a massive breach in the hull. Old news, Friday. Tell me about something I didn't just jump out of. Scanning. There's an engine fire that needs your attention. <laughs> A secondary explosion on the right engine, sir. Got it. Fire suppression system online. Okay. Visor's crossed roofs. That's one less burning issue to deal with. Good job, sir. Sir, the autopilot is no longer responding, and the jet is projected to crash into a populated area. I'll deal with the autopilot. Uh -huh. No! Stay put! It's too dangerous! Says the guy who jumped out of the plane! Any more from our mystery guest? They're giving us the silent treatment, but their hounds are clawing at the door. Show them in. Bolsa!
Friday. What's going on in there? Scanning for Miss Potts. Our new friends messing with my HUD. They've also locked me out of the Jets' diagnostics. I have no read on Miss Potts. Pepper, do you copy? Enemies inbound. Pepper! Pepper, come in! Pepper! You okay in there? Tony, I have control of the jet. Keep the good news coming. Sir, more hostiles en route. Friday, what did I just say? System, aren't they? Pepper, how's the jet? No longer out of collision course with Los Angeles. City Council will be pleased to know that. on the left side has been damaged. Is that fixable? I'll have to wing it. That looks better. I've located an airstrip for emergency landing. Thanks, Friday. Pepper, you think you can land this bird? Only one way to find Of course they are. Make a wish! It's all yours, Pepper. Gear is down. Three green. Well done, both of you. If no one has any further objections, I say we call it. I'm detecting a new energy signature. More enemies? Good. Trigger fingers getting itchy. Sidestep their attack, sir. Yeah! I'm sensing our hacker friend has returned. <laughs> Friday? Friday? All systems are down. The big one's back. My controls are locked! Pepper! It's vanished from radar. I can see that. Get me back online. Systems restored. Tony, nothing's responding here. Sir, I believe the jet is officially a lost cause. Pepper, find an exit! <coughs> the fire trapped in the cabin! <coughs> I'm trapped! <coughs> Miss Potts, there's a panel beneath your feet, a compartment. It leads to the nose landing gear. You under the jet!
next time, I want my own suit. Usually, I see the danger before it hits, even from 20,000 feet. But someone got the drop on us. It was 3 a.m. when I left Pepper at the hospital. I had a plan, and I knew she wouldn't like it. I went home, and I woke up the guy who knows my old weapons better than anyone. once. Just... just this once. Hello, old friend. Hey, boss. Hey, pal. Where's the party? Wherever you go. <laughs> oh. Great. I smell like feet. Whoa, ho, ho. Blast from the past. It's a power core from an old drone. You recognize it? <laughs> of course I recognize it, I built it. Huh. That's odd. There's no serial number. Where's it from? Hoping you can tell me. Sir. Miss Potts has been moved to a secure location, but her... Sorry, I didn't realize we had company. I'm more like family. Uh, Friday, this is the gun smash. You bring me up to speed here, Dom. Hey! I'm not a touch screen. Gunsmith, show some respect. Wait, shh, 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 shh. Oh, no. Miss Potts. She's... She's in hospital. And the cowards that put her there? Still at large. Help me find them. No, oh, we'll find them, boss. And when we do... That. A little early in the morning for power cords.
Time to head to the garage. Did Gunsmith drag this thing out of storage? It's growing on me. Friday. Any update on our enemy's whereabouts? Afraid not. It's that hard light, sir. Our enemy cloaked your old drones in a type of energy we've not encountered before, allowing them to appear out of nowhere. Hey, boss, you're up. <laughs> So's the neighborhood. Turn that down, will you? Meet me over at your suit when you have a sec. I got a surprise for you. He's... Passionate? I'll give him that. Wow. You have really gone all in on the whole superhero thing, haven't you? Did you find out where those drones came from yet? So serious. And yes. I mean, no. I mean, I will. But I've been thinking. You've built a pretty great suit. But I think I can make it even better. Standing on the shoulders of giants, of course. Pal, I brought you back to figure you out... You brought me back because we're in a street fight. And you know I don't pull any punches. Just take a look. All right, give me the sales pitch. So, I've analyzed your armor and found places where we could make potential upgrades. You can view and customize the equipment in each of these slots by activating their corresponding UI widget. Go ahead, boss. Select one of the auxiliary weapon slots.
This virtual workstation is where you can choose equipment to build and integrate into your suit. You can put together all kinds of gunpowder-based goodies here, boss. Let's start with smart missiles. If you want to arm yourself with knowledge as well as hardware, the specs on each weapon appear above the hollow table. For now, let's go ahead and build these. When it comes to this stuff, boss, I always say the more the merrier. Equip those smart missiles to your other arm, too. Oh, good thinking, pal. Now let's go see what these beauties can do. It'd be a tragedy not to, boss. But feel free to mess around with your suit some more if you want. And when you're ready, I'll still have you test the smart missiles first. Cause, well, that's how I designed the module. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Stark Raving, the financial advice podcast the pros, finance bros, and CEOs never miss. I'm your host, Morgan Stark, the man with the money gene, the name that's synonymous with richness, and yes, for those of you only just now checking us out because of my robocall ad campaign, I am Tony Stark's cousin. And Tony isn't the only Stark who knows how to make money. So get ready for an intense injection of invaluable insight straight from the Stark's mouth. Let's jump right into it. Everyone wants to talk about Tony naming Virginia Potts, her friends call her Pepper, because, you know, I'm, I'm not exactly sure why. Anyway, Tony made her the new CEO of Stark Industries, stepping aside to focus on the business of being a superhero. But don't fret, Stark. Gonna be sore tomorrow. <sighs> the armor would make a good ankle weight. <sighs> These are the kind of guns worth building. Could have used a spotter. Clean living, a novel concept.
The sweet science. Knock it! And the gloves come off. Nice hook here. Hook there. Passable. The Gunsmith AI's brand of help came with a warning label. But I was concerned about the night of, not the morning after. It felt like stumbling back into an old haunt after years away. There was no judgment, no, where have you been? Just, what do you have? you today, sir. Gunsmith suggested I brush up on the fundamentals. Oh, did he? That's a surprise coming from him. But encouraging, I suppose. What would you like to do first? Let's start with ground pound. Oh, I love this one. Let me find a good place to test this out. Good. I recommend you manually engage thrusters to focus on ground pound. Give me a target to hit. How do you aim it, sir? I pick a spot, and then make a fist. And... Bam! Another target, please, Friday. Right. 
I admire your handiwork, sir. That's nothing. Friday, give me nine targets. Nine, sir? Well, someone's feeling brash. I can hit them all if I do this right. Smashing, sir. What's next? Smart missiles. Oh, something Gunsmith made. Sir, I was under the impression you brought him back to locate the source of your old drones. He's a skilled multitasker, just like me. Indeed, sir. It's just... Well, I thought we were brushing up on the fundamentals and... That's right, Friday. And these wrist-mounted beauties put the fun in fundamental. So give me a new target. Please. Certainly, sir. Move to position. Okay, these are auxiliary weapons, so hands up, palms down. Got it. Try aiming with your left gauntlet, paint the target, and fire. Whoa! Those pack a punch! Try aiming with your right gauntlet, sir. Paint all of the targets this time. Gunsmith is not messing around. Instead, why don't we review your repulses, sir? Sure, I know these. Hands up, palms forward. You're old hat at this. I mean, I am Iron Man. Beautiful. Let's test weapon switching. Repulsors, palms up. Auxiliaries, palms down. Certainly. Yellow for repulsors, red for auxiliaries. Excellent. All right, Friday. Time to take this show on the road. Huh. Gunsmith got the formula just right. <laughs> Feels like the good old days. a lot of fine ingredients. Let's throw them in the pot together. A cooking class, sir. Excellent idea. I'll set up the flight course. <laughs> All right. Time to rock and roll. Three punch combo. Left, right, left. Bonus to your performance.
always impressive, but I bet you could break one minute if you try again. No, I should save some of this firepower for our mystery friend. Very well. <laughs> 